I'm back and this time I remembered my glasses. Let me just fix this. There we go. There we go. I have this constant sense of foreboding surrounding me for for some reason. And I don't know why. I feel as if I am missing something. But the thing is, I don't know what I am missing. And everything just seems very empty. As you can tell by my emo hair. <laughs> but... I don't like this because, at least with actively going to school, sure, it may suck. Sure, every morning I get the same awful stomach aches, same awful sense of, hey, this is gonna go wrong, you loser. And with this, I've genuinely lost track of time, which usually happens anyway, but worse now. And I can't really keep track of anything, and I feel like I've been being more of a pain in the butt to my family. I'm getting to the point where I'm so close to just, like, straight up not having a good time. <laughs> I don't know how to word it to make me not sound like a five-year-old. But just thinking about it makes me, like, ooh. So my sister, or my family, they're kind of, like, up close and, like, in your business, and I'm like, no thanks. And I don't like things being up close to my face. And my sister, she keeps like snapping in my face. And every time I'm like, what the f And I get so incredibly angry. And I do this thing where I just kind of like shake my head. And um, I do this too. But I don't like people violating my personal space. And it was really gross having to go through that entire situation. So if that applies to anything you do, you're not alone. Or if it doesn't apply to anyone, I'm just really sensitive. But that's no big deal. So that's really all I had to say was being in close quarters is making me a lot more irritable than usual. And it's making me react to a lot more stimuli if you want to use the scientific term since i was almost a science major <laughs> i gave that up to being an art major so being home home trapped in a place with a lot of loud noises is not good for me that's why i spend most of my time in my room with the occasional bird <laughs> and that's all i really had to say